All right, guys, in this video, I'll be teaching you guys how to create this awesome looking audio spectrum effect in After Effects. Before I start this awesome tutorial, I need to say a couple things. First of all, thank you so much for 1000 subscribers. I never knew I would actually be able to reach this amazing milestone and I wouldn't be here if it wasn't for you guys. Secondly, I'll be doing a free liquid transition giveaway in my discord server to celebrate this. But don't worry if you don't win it, you can use code ARIEL1K for 20% off your first purchase on my official website store. Once again, thank you all so much and let's get right into the video. Enjoy! Alright, so once you open up your brand new After Effects composition, go ahead and hit Ctrl Y on your keyboard and your composition. And then this little tab should show up and choose any kind of name you like. But I'll be naming it Audio Spectrum. And then choose your composition size as your width and height. And then choose any color you would like. Go ahead and click OK. And then once you do that, go ahead and hit your Effects and Presets tab and search up Audio Spectrum. And then this little effect should show up and then go ahead and drag it onto your solid layer. Once you do that, your default color should disappear and a pinkish color should show up. Go ahead and select any color you would like for that. So I'll be choosing a nice white and then choose the same color right here. Once you do that, your color should be changed and you should be all good. Now, if you want to follow my tutorial and make it look like a circle, go ahead and follow my tutorial, but you wouldn't have to do it if you just want to make it a line. Go ahead and select your circle layer right here, and if you don't have it as a circle right here, go ahead and long click this, and then select your ellipse tool. After you do that, go ahead and select your audio spectrum layer, and then across the screen just drag it while pressing shift on your keyboard. Then it should create a perfect circle shape. After you do that, hit V on your keyboard, and then double click this little line you see. Once you do that, this little selection should show up. So what you want to do now is align it perfectly to the center. If you have your align tab right here, go ahead and hit the align horizontally and align vertically. And then you should centerize it by yourself. If you don't have your align tab, go ahead and hit window and then click align right here. Once you do that, what you want to do is select your audio spectrum layer right again, and then go to your path selection and then hit mask one. And then it should show up as a little line right here. Once you do that, let's go ahead and actually pull up our audio layer. So I'll be back when I bring my audio layer. Alright, so I've got my audio layer right now. And go ahead and select your audio layer and hit L twice. And then it should show up a waveform selection right here. After that, all you want to do is select a favorite selection of your song that will fit into the composition. So I'll be selecting this part. Alright, so now what you want to do is select audio spectrum and then click here and then click audio. Now what you want to do is just preview it. Alright, I think it looks pretty good in my opinion. So what you guys want to do is uh, control this and customize it as much as you want and choose your favorite color, choose any shape you would like and choose any side you would like. So for example, in this, uh, in this case, if I select side A, it will only show up in the bottom section, so inside section. So it will look like this. And if I select the side B, it will only show in the outside section just like this. So, as you can see, you can play around a lot with this really cool effect. So, you can change your maximum height so it's much higher. You can also change your thickness and you can really do anything. It's really fun to play around with and I really use this effect a lot in my videos. Well, that's pretty much it for today's video. I'm so sorry I haven't been uploading for a bit. I have been super busy with all my schoolwork and other things that I needed to do. Thank you so much for watching though and I am really, really thankful for 1000 subscribers. Thank you so much and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!